Go ahead. Um, yeah, I, going back to the branding and the change in the branding, I feel like you may have gone a little too far on the subtle side. I mean, I don't get nearly as many questions from the non-believers on the ship as I have in past years because the badges just, they don't stand out in the same way. And so a little more color or a little more of a style that, that's not quite so corporate. This I could see this for a corporate retreat for a not very interesting company. Oh, this is a corporate retreat for a not very interesting company. <laughs> I have Welcome to disagree to... on that. <laughs> I work for that company. I work for a lot of not very interesting companies. We're just so transitioning into next year when we're changing the name to um, World Amal Amalgamated Incorporated. <laughs> it's just going to be Joe Co. <laughs> No, I hear you. I hear you. The the it's true. The new design is is uh, is uh, more. I I I love the new design. I but one of my favorite things about cruising is the I don't know the sort of like old old fashioned the weird old fashioned vibe of a cruise vacation. Uh, and uh, to you know, for me, one of the things I like about the design is it does sort of like capture this sort of lost elegance. And it would be hard to describe this experience as elegant anymore. But there was a time in the past when this was, you know, very fancy, elegant form of travel. Um, and so that's, I think that's some of the stuff that, that I see in the design. And, you know, the, as, for the, as for the badges themselves, they're, they're going to continue to change every year. Uh, so, yeah, who knows? Next year it might be just a picture of... Uh, uh, and Tom Cruise with a bloody knife. Or next thing. year you might have actual monkeys hanging around here. <laughs> <laughs> and it is also um, meant to be a bit of a, a blank slate in that we, we went through a lot of different design options and it just seemed like to do something that was really specific uh, kind of locks it down and that it, it's not going to change anything about how people relate to one another and the events and the rest and that will likely be adding things each year that play off of it, but to have that, that central thing, it's sort of everything that we do will become invested in these images, and it's gonna, it'll look very different three years from now because of uh, what we do here on the cruise. And uh, if it makes you feel any better, we have some pretty wacky ideas for 2016. I want a six-finger badge. <laughs> six-finger badge, yes. We are, we are certain six fingers will work somehow into some form of merchandising next year. I think we would be uh, both remiss and keel-hauled if we did not include that to some extent. So. Hold me in. six fingers. six. We should give some sort of discount to some, the first person. Uh, like, I don't the six-finger discount? The first, pe first person to graft a six-finger under their hand. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, please yeah. don't graft a six-finger under your hand. Do not. We don't don't, don't say those things out loud, Paul. Oh, I just left a clue. This young lady over here. I had a six-finger. Uh, no, that doesn't count. It has to be new. Yeah. 